Hello everybody, so my name is Marco Wittmuch. I'm a commercial photographer here of Glamour Pixel Photo Design in Germany. And today I would like to talk about product photography. So I have done already um, some commercial pictures on white background for a customer. And um, when the photo shooting was ready, the customer called me and said, well, Mr. Wittmuch, so the pictures are great. But the white background, well, that's usual in the most uh, shops, online shops in the web. But uh, I would like to have a photo which is um, better and has more mood in it and more spirit and looks better at least. So it is about this uh, little bottle here. It uh, looks a bit like a perfume bottle, but it isn't. It's a tattoo cream, what you can apply to your skin when you have a fresh made tattoo. And uh, the tricky thing about this bottle is here, it has a transparent cap with a dispenser inside, a chrome high reflective neck here, and of course a very glossy surface here. And um, I would like to show you a special photo shooting here, which I have done in the Glamour Pixel Studio One, just there. And just come with me and uh, look how I built the light setup and what I've done in uh, post-production here. So let's go on. Well, add this tattoo cream, add some moisture to the skin. Uh, I thought uh, water underground with some nice water ripples should be fine. So this is a total studio setup in my studio. So with the Capture One uh, station and Canon uh, 5D Mark III with the macro lens 100 millimeter attached. And you can see that I have the um, raw processed um, uh, digital files there. And this is a shooting table. So with the water on it, and um, if uh, we look to the camera connection, so it is set up for tethered shooting, so I can make a live shooting to the station. And here we have the key light, so it's a 250 watt seconds Hensel light with a softbox. And for the rim light on both sides, I have created a symmetrical light. So I have even softed uh, the softboxes once more with self-made diffusers, diffusion panels. Um, what I have made and if I go here uh, to the back of the setup you can see uh, this is a background light so I have used a honeycomb grid and uh, the reflection of the background will also be visible in the water and especially in the water ripples to make the ripples more visible and that you have more definition in the ripples and here you have the back side of um, yeah the back of the station which i've uh, newly set up and um, yeah this is the total setup and um, let's see how i have been working with it So the tricky thing for this shooting was the exact timing of uh, the dro dropping the bottle into the water and get this nice ripple. And at the same time, I have used the remote shutter for making the photo. So it took uh, some training and around 30 pictures to get it done. So and this is the final image what I sent to the customer. Um, of course, I have removed some fine scratches and dust and so with uh, Photoshop in post-production. So using the clone stamp and the healing brush mainly. And as you see, uh, I have applied a blue, um, yet a blue style to the whole picture because I thought this would perfectly fit to this uh, water and ripples on the ground. So, um, of course, I could have invested even more time to post-production, that is clear. But on the other side, um, I would like to see my images a bit realistic and that the customer does not uh, think that it is CGI, so computer-generated imaging. So I would like to have a, a, at least a small amount of realistic touch in my photos. So um, yes, that's all for the moment. Thanks for watching. Please visit us on www.glamapixel.de. See you. Bye.